Der Limburger Dom. Das Besondere ist doch, dass er 800 Jahre alt ist. Es gibt keinen vergleichbaren Bau in der ganzen Welt. Einmal schon mit seinen sieben Türmen ist er wie eine Krone über der Stadt Limburg. Ja, eine besondere Herausforderung ist, dieses wertvolle Kulturgut für die Nachwelt bestmöglich zu erhalten. Ich bin Bruder Elmar, ich bin der Domküster hier am Limburger Dom im Land Hessen. In der letzten Zeit mussten wir feststellen, dass sich immer wieder kleine Putzteile gelöst haben, beziehungsweise Dachziegel und Blei, äh, sagen wir, Abdeckungen gelöst haben. Die Vielschichtigkeit in der Architektur, wo wir einfach nicht äh, Einsicht haben können, dazu brauchen wir einfach Fachleute oder Fachfirmen. My name is Philip Batros and I work as a UAV operator in 3D surveying. Surfen Digital is a company in Germany and we are specialized in 3D scanning of buildings like cathedrals or single objects in high detail. For this we use drones and laser scanners to get the best results of both worlds. It's challenging because capturing architectural details such as significant structural elements, sculptural works, and of course any damage to the building. With the 3D model, we have a comprehensive model accessible to most stakeholders. The collaboration of different teams allows for quicker and better informed decisions. The data is for long-term monitoring to compare before and after conditions or track the progression of cracks. When scanning such large buildings with the Maverick 3 Enterprise, I have to keep an overview in manual flight and still maintain an even overlap and order in the image sequence for the process to work. I manage around 5,000 photos a day. The process works well, but it's incredibly tiring for the pilot. With the new Matrice 4, the five-directional oblique capture and close-range photography features offer a 3D point cloud preview for planning flight routes in real time. Flight paths are possible very close to the surface and much more coordinated. Each photo contains highly accurate positioning information about the individual position. Take the photos with an ideal overlap uncompromisingly, extremely quickly and fully automatically. This is an impressive and safe planning feature for surveying. I think and hope acceptance of the use of digital tools will continue to increase. The use of 3D models is evolving in such a way that the systems for capturing data are becoming smarter and smarter. The 3D results will benefit from this. AI-supported tools will certainly bring more intelligence and classification to the evaluation, reconstruction and analysis of data.